Hello everyone. In this video we will learn about how to see details on audiences. Along with this, we will also understand how to duplicate an audience and how to delete an audience. Let's dive in. If I want to see the details of what purchasers are doing, I can directly click on purchasers. and I'll get the report. So it's a very small report as of now, but here we can see one user. There is no app version. We can go to the device category and we can see it's desktop. We can see it with OS version as well. And we can see it's a, it was a windows laptop. And what was the platform? It was web. We can also see conversions. So one conversion and engage session zero. Let's go back. If you want to change the report for this particular audience, you can do that. Now I can select that same report for the Facebook audience. And now we can see there is no data available for the Facebook audience. Now, if you want to compare two different audiences, we can do that by clicking on add comparison. We have already made a detailed video on how to compare different dimensions. Please visit that video to understand how to compare different audiences. Links in the description. Now let's go to audiences. And now for example, I want to delete non purchasers. I'll click on the three dots and I can click archive. Once I click archive, there is no way I can retrieve this particular audience. I have to recreate it. So be sure that you want to delete an audience and understand that the data will be lost. So right now I'll not do this. Uh, again, if I want to create a duplicate of this particular audience, I can click on duplicate. And now you can see a duplicate of that particular audience is created. For example, if I only want e-commerce purchases, I can now remove this and this audience will be only non purchasers. E-commerce. As we can see with the help of duplicate, we didn't have to create complete audience and have put the setting again. I hope this was helpful. Thank you so much.